Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Venice. You are witnessing us taking our very first steps off of our bus. I'm really excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. This is real, everybody. Oh my god. It looks like a film set. That is no joke. It's absolutely stunning, and it's so quiet today. We're absolutely spoilt. We haven't even gotten near the bridge yet, and already our favorite thing is just wandering through all the little back streets. The phone has no idea where we are, so maps are pretty much useless to us. The phone is just gradually just, just... disappearing farther and farther away from where we actually are. We're in the sea, apparently, but this is so worth it. It doesn't even matter because the back streets are beautiful. Prime example, map told us to take a right. <laughs> A right and into the canals. Lol, back we go. You don't get that anywhere else in the world. Just chilling, watching the gondolas go by. I wish I could step back about 500 minutes and not eat that much food. <laughs> We're kind of aimlessly wandering and trying to work off dinner. Can we sit please? Can we just sit? Can we just sit here? We are on to the next stop, which is Piazza di San Marco. Is that how you say it, Danny? Piazza di San Marco? Del San Marco? Piazza di San Marco. <laughs> we are so unrefined. We were advised that even just to sit down here at the piazza could cost you up to 25 euro in a cover charge. So please be aware of that. If you are sitting down to have a coffee for four people, it could be about 100 euro. So that's not great. But it is a great place to come in and take in the views of the Basilica, the museum, which is free, and also enjoy some live music. <laughs> the other islands are these yeah I'm fairly sure they're the other yeah. islands area. yeah we'll be going out to one of them tomorrow which one's that Chanel? Murano and or Murano maybe both Murano we'll probably do them all the glasses. Murano glass yeah which will be brilliant and then Murano is like a little fishing town much quieter than this very colourful so I'd love to see that too I said no we weren't going to go into Gucci because I don't want to be a peasant person but we're going into Gucci so I can be a peasant person so I don't think we mentioned that we actually got a night train last night and spent most of the night trying to sleep cross-legged on a train which was great fun so we're very very tired after spending the whole day walking around it's time for some cocktails and beer and food at the hotel which is famous for its glassware. The Vaporetto over here was something else though. Did you see the size of those waves? If you are in any way afraid of the sea, that is very, very frightening. Murano is made up of seven islands and it's essentially the same as Venice, but it's a ton quieter. There are not as many people. Those damn tourists. <laughs> Please, Danny, no paps. Thank you. We're crossing one of the bridges over into the shade that's the most important thing today if you can see we walked up this whole way here there is 0.00 shade and i am melting so let's roll our pasty irish selves are not equipped for this fantastic weather get me in out of it five minutes ago all right danny this is about the extent of our travels for today <laughs> we just set up camp here it's too hot follow this shade as it moves around <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And now, 
eat her gelato before it turns into a slushy. Too late for mine. <laughs> so funny. I'm hilarious. Danny, I wouldn't reckon there's too many car accidents in Venice, would you? Uh, I'd say it's probably below average. <laughs> Lol. You're welcome for the dad joke. This is my favorite thing about Italy so far. Fresh pasta. I had some ravioli last night for dinner. It was A1. I love how everything is fresh here. We were talking about making fresh pasta before we even came here in a couple of our videos, if you've seen those ones. And so I think that's gonna be on the list when we do get back. Make some fresh pasta and relive our Italy days. Rather, Danny will be making fresh pasta and allowing me to relive my Italy days. <laughs> Oh, I got completely sidetracked by a fabulous dinner in the hotel. But we are back on the main island of Venice and it is every bit as gorgeous as we thought it would be in the evening. Just look at these views while we sign off for the night. I hope you enjoyed our Venice stay. This has to be top of one of my most favorite places we've ever visited. If you enjoyed our Venice stay as well, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and hit subscribe to follow on on the rest of our journey. And we will see you in Rome.